Yo guys, I'm Critico and this is Crazy Peggy right over Hello. there. This is our second episode, right? No, our third episode. And oh boy, she's getting better though. Can you believe it or not? I mean, things are going rather well. And uh, Peggy, let's just buff each other. We have to drink the two potions again. I cannot buff you though, so I don't care about that. Uh, but yeah, Elixir of Minor Defense. And a Weak Troll's Blood Potion you have to drink. And good that you're buffing yourself too. Very nice. Yeah, come on, drink it, girl. Drink the green potion. And the black one next to it. All right. Yeah, now the other one. Nice. All right. Get alchemy, guys. If you're playing on your own, get alchemy. If you're playing duo, get alchemy. And if you don't have a main, get alchemy, right, you know? But oh boy. Three buffs like this 50 armor increase two health every two uh, every five seconds and that with a warlock three health every five seconds we get five health every two seconds though isn't that cool as a warlock but anyhow right you know it is very cool to be back and we are having a grand freaking gnome adventure here i mean man last time i did this was in actually uh vanilla itself though 19 years ago that i played with a friend from college, two gnomes. Oh, Peggy's under a heavy attack there. Peggy, walk back. Yeah, run, 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 run. You don't have to run, though. You can kill both of them. But please be careful, all right? Oh, Peggy, drink a healing potion. You're dying. All right. Oh, my God. Please be careful, though. Please be freaking careful. The adventure was almost over. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? And just because of greed, always check your surroundings. Yeah, picking up flowers is greed, man. Oh my god. I cannot fear yet. I cannot do anything to protect you yet, though. Be careful, all right? <laughs> That's not funny. I have to say, though, I have rather large feet footprints for a little gnome, right? It's almost as big as my head is, though. That's quite impressive, man. All right, Peggy, welcome to the forward camp. Uh, this is where yeah, the dwarf did set some reinforcements for Ironforge. All right. I have a cask of Evershine handy, but can you do me a favor? Oh my. Brunel Village could use a hand against the wild animals that wander the nearby snows. Sometimes they wander close. We're not afraid of these bears and cats and boars. No self-respecting dwarf would be. But if you can take care of those animals for us, then we'd have more time for our crafting and brewing. I'm on a quest. A quest to make the perfect stout. I know I can do it. Brewing's in my blood. I just need to find the right recipe. The Frostmane trolls grow a plant, shimmerweed, high up in the hills to the east. They use it in their strange tribal rituals. We dwarves haven't found much use for it, but it has a unique taste. And I want to experiment with it in my brood. Get me some shimmerweed from Frostmane Seers, or swipe it from the troll shimmerweed baskets. I have to admit, those thunder brews make some good drinks. But they need to learn that theirs isn't the only decent brew. Maybe you can help me teach them that lesson. Here, take this barrel of barley brew scalder. Sneak into the basement of the thunder brew distillery in Paranos switch it with one of their barrels of thunder ale then we'll see how their patrons like my brew over theirs and if the barrels are oh, 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 oh. They might have to distract the guard yeah don't worry at level 10 i'm getting a pet you know that's very cool i get fear too then which is very powerful so they are running around like little chicken without head though but don't forget peggy to run right if you run i can still nuke them you know that's very important and these are my favorite type of missions, though, right? If you are going to play in groups. Just to nuke the F out of your enemies. Beautiful stuff, man, you know. And lovely location, nice calm music. I do enjoy it. It reminds me that we did play Lord of the Rings online together, remember? Two weird-ass hobbits. And remember why we did set our adventure out of the Shire? Because Frodo forgot to pay us back. Yeah. We did pay for his uh, his drinks, you know, the night before he left, you know. And, um, yeah, well, we heard that he was uh, going away on an adventure or something. But we thought it was an excuse. 
because he didn't pay us you know uh, some some money back right you know this is what it is okay that um that bastard over there did uh, steal it yeah ugly dwarf oh yeah but the thing though is right you know we didn't think that he will just run away right you know for let's say 10 beers and some something to eat kind of weird but oh well Why would she target that mob when she's not going to kill it? Peggy, click on him and buff him, please. Thank you. He did buff us with stamina after all. Yep, very good. Well, that's kind of funny, though. Let's just pretend that we didn't see that he's being attacked right there. <laughs> I'm so mean. Oh, look at that. He wants help, though. Yeah, he's dying there. I'm not... Nah, he's not, though. He wants us to kill everything. He could easily have killed it, though. What the... Alright, kill it. Don't worry, Peggy, about me. Attack your target always. Don't take, uh, attack my target until I say it, right? Look at him, though, staring. So we helped him, you know? Thank you, guys. It seems the guy I both died and uh, inherited his pig. No, 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 no. That's not how it works. <laughs> he went out of the aggro zone, though. That's it. Yep. And then he returned. Oh, yeah. For a whole lot of trouble from Peggy's mother. Oh, by the way, Peggy, like I said before, right? I have five healing points per time. You can agree that. Uh, don't worry about it. Um, But greet it. Click on greed, Peggy. On the coin down below. Yes, yes, no. Buy your health bars. No, left. Yes, yeah. Very good. Such a big pop-up on the screen. And Peggy's like, oh, where is it? Where is it? <laughs> hey, 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 Peggy, don't cry. All right. Now, let's see. No, huh? She made a special macro so she can get some pity from you guys, huh? Yeah. How manipulating. How manipulating. Peggy, do you know what I have to say about that? <laughs> no, wrong one. <laughs> this bullion is really doing me good right now. Damn. Some, um, some soup broth, though. We are a little bit sick, though, huh? Yeah, sick in the mind, Peggy. But anyways, you know, it feels good right now. It, it really does. <laughs> Chugga, chugga, chugga. Let's go. Let's kill. Come, my demon. Kill them all. Oh, chugga, 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 chug, chug. Chugga, 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 chug, chug. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure there was a demon inside of me right now, though. After all, I'm a warlock. I need to concentrate a little bit more. We battle against the fell hordes. Nice little stick you're holding in your hands, Peggy. <laughs> Very cute, though. Nice magic wand. All right, be careful around here, all right? There can be a lot of bad boys spawning in. Lots of troll boys and so on. But we do need the shimmer weed. And of course, you know, these... These voodoo boys from Jamaica, right? Of course they are carrying the voodoo weed. And by the way, they can heal themselves. I'm just saying. <laughs> gotta be very careful. Some of them can, I believe. And I got a debuff, man. Fairy fire. Armor reduced by 216. I don't even have 200. 
Well, I, I have a little bit. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Go back, go back. There are too many there. Way too many. And too much of a higher level than we are right now. This way. This way, peg it. Ew. There's a gnome there. So we put him on the fire, Peggy. Now, um, can you loot these baskets? Oh, damn it. That one is attacking me already. Don't worry. Pick up the other one, too. The other one? Yep. Yeah. Oh, Peggy pulled the other one. That's okay. Oh, that other luckily ass, uh... The one to the left of me. Pick it. Oh my dude, though. This guy. He's not even helping, but he's stealing what we are fighting for. Nice. What an ugly ass, huh? What an ugly ass. All right. Peggy, collect all the baskets that you do see, though, before he does it. Peggy, that's mine, you idiot. <laughs> yeah, you take that one. All right. <laughs> Be careful, though, because they will be spawn-ins rather soon, right? All right, very good, very good. <clears throat> I mean, if you are stealing one, okay, sure, but you, Peggy, you have them done. You have them done. You are done, you are done. But if you're stealing one or two, you gotta help out a little bit, right? Especially if people are fighting for you. There you go. All right, let's move. What's up, Peggy? I will protect you. There you go. <laughs> Everything is secure. Yeah, I know. Scary, right? I protected her, don't you worry. She will make snacks for you later on, I am sure about it. For the evil bunny has been slain. Alright, good that Peggy cannot, um, you know, talk like that. Very good, right? And by the way, um, we could actually go like no is common. But later, I believe we can also do demonic as a warlock. Yeah, I believe so, right? So we only... Warlocks can communicate with one another then. That's rather cool, man. And gnomes can only communicate with other gnomes, say, or dwarves or night elves. It's really, really cool. Killing for fun, Peggy. Oh, yeah, for the experience of slaughter. Oh no, Rasputin is going down. My first um, minion was actually called... My very, very first one in vanilla was called Raputin. So I always called him Rasputin, right? Good memories, man. Good memories. Fond memories. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, no, no. There's one. Yes. The one to the right. In this game, Peggy, you're so easily surrounded by enemies. Seriously, though. It's hyper dangerous, man. Hey! What does he do? Oh my god, Peggy, there isn't one incoming. Okay, no, it's not. My little minion wants us to die. Ra, ra, Rasputin. Yeah, Rupert, protect the Peggy. There you go. Uh, Ropat actually likes Peggy quite a bit because he's crazy and he says Peggy's possessed by a demon. That's why she's crazy. I'm not sure if that's correct though, but um, I don't care. Chugga, 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 chugga. Exactly. Out of nowhere though, you know, she thinks about the deep run of uh, yeah, the deep run trap uh, mine. Uh, no, no, no. Tram. Yeah. Deep run tram. Yeah, that's it.
Ele é orelha, não queria que é de gondade dele, hein? Congratulations, Peggy. Peggy, wanna hear a little secret? Yeah? Well, the thing though is, right, we are now going to kill some of the best targets to kill. Gnomes. Yeah! <laughs> ah, it's going to be fun, Peggy. We're going to kill gnomes. Seems like they are all already dead by this human over here. Found one. The uh, radioactive gnomes, Peggy. Can you believe it? Radioactive gnomes. See that dude. That human loves it so much that he just goes back. You know, he's done. He finds another one and just goes back. That is dedication to exterminate all the gnomes. I like it. Oh, I'm being left from behind, Peggy. There you go. Don't worry, though. I can tank quite a bit, right, you know? Regenerating health and everything. Good, decent uh, armor. There we are. Rasputin, why, Rulput? What a name, though, right? Rulpat. I hope my Void Walker gets a very cool name too, huh? Lepanome, Lepanome, gonna die today. I'm sure he didn't expect that, huh? When he woke up. Peggy, you're kind of crazy, huh? Taking two targets at once. Oh, no! Three targets! You gotta hurry up right now, though. Rupert is going to get pwned. Oh, Rupert died almost. My boy. Wow, look at that little bit of health. He only has two HP left. Don't worry, Rupert. I will protect you. Even though Peggy's mean to you, by pulling more than that she can chew. Oh. Alright, Peggy, don't forget to loot them all, right? We have to collect quite a lot of gears and stuff. Peggy, don't forget you have longer distance than that you're fighting on right now, right? You know? Um, yeah. I wanted to pull this one off you. Oh, that other one is getting away. Oh, he's pulling enemies. No. Oh. Okay, that one is coming back. Yeah, and he pulled another one. Going towards Peggy, of course. Oh boy, I can curse him, but... Peggy, you gotta be a little bit more careful, alright? Just a little bit. I don't want you to die. Peggy's like, what the F am I doing, big boy? You're walking a little bit too close to them, you know, and then you cannot really... Well, then you're pulling them by aggro range, right? And by the way, if you want to see the range that you have, do you see number one, two, three on your hotbar? If they turn red, you are too far away from your enemies. If they turn gray, you can cast an enemy spell. Of, I mean, you're not an enemy spell, but you can cast a spell then. Try it out on this guy inside here. Yeah, or that guy there, you know. But don't attack him. Oh, don't attack him, Peggy, damn it. Yeah. Got another dude here. Peggy, run. Come, come. No, turn around. Look around, Peggy. Run. Oh, my God. I got a whole world on my, upon my ass right now. Run, Peggy. Next time, listen, please, damn it. <laughs> run. Oh, why are you running a different way? I always run the same direction. What if you're pulling more? You're almost going to a higher level town. My dude. Keep running. Ropet is almost dead. Yeah, Ropet is dead. All right, kill this one. No, cannot. Oh my God, Peggy. Be careful, please. Oh my God. Yeah, I'm going to cry too. There we go. We almost died. My dude. <laughs> click it. Click it, Peggy. You forgot your, all the flowers, huh? 
Look at the flowers, Peggy, while I'm putting a curse on you. As a warlock, right? Hey, I can do that. The thing, though, is they do spawn in. And if you're pulling from far away, that one can pull from close to him, too. And then the spawns are just going to attack us, too, right? It's, it's so dangerous. Very exciting, though. Another one pulled in. See what I mean? And it doesn't help that they are a level higher than we are, you know? Hoppa! Three after another. That's what I mean. So dangerous. So very, very dangerous. But yeah, Peggy, always be sure that we are running in the same direction, right? I know what you try to do, I think, is to hope that he will split up and attack us both. But together, we could still survive quite a lot, right? You know, if we are walking together and running at the same distance. Because then we are not pulling any enemies with us, you know, along the way from different paths. You know what I mean? Because let's say, imagine, right? You know, like five of these little bastards do run after us, right? And we get rid of them. But then, uh-oh, one wolf you pulled and one wolf I pulled. We have to fight two wolves then, alone, because we are in different parts. But if we both pulled one wolf, we could easily kill it still. With tactical, right? Smart brains. Yep, very smart. I know, I know. Wow. A level 5 just uh, died. Sad, man, you know. Sad. It happens, though. Right, Peggy? It happens. Almost happened to us, right, Peggy? Right. <laughs> oh, man. It, it just takes some bad luck at times or some horrible luck, right? Some hyper spawns here and there. It's just bad. Somebody already died there, by the way, right? Now live. Interesting uh, spot, though. Right at the entrance of the town. We're almost done here, by the way, I see. Not bad. Nice, I'm done, it seems, with one of them. Which is cool. I only need one more of the restabilization. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, cogs. Oh no. Oh no, Peggy. No, no. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Yep, there we go. I'm kind of happy, though, that I uh, do tank most of it. All right, congratulations. Peggy's done with one attack. Hey, this guy looks kind of like this guy on the floor there. Don't help him out. Don't, don't, don't. Oh, oh, oh. So we surprise him and let just the enemy spawn upon him. <laughs> oh, no, that will be so mean. All right. He's already running. <laughs> he has too many upon him. That's what you get, you little one. Let's help him out with two attacks. Nothing more. But that one will probably run back towards us. Probably. Alright, I'm done. Uh, Peggy, you can pick this one up. Uh, Peggy's done too. Alright, very cool. Very cool. Let's go a little bit further. We actually might go and deliver this one first, right? Yeah, sure. Alright, uh, let's deliver right over here. Nice. And I will choose the brace, though. Ivy so Reef Braces. Here's your cask of and wear it, by the way. Very important again, stuff. Thank you for the hunting. Great. I can't wait to use these in some of my recipes. Oh, and by There's the way, Peggy, sell stuff, except linen cloth, I'd like my brother to and my stuff that staff. you do need He's for your quest. Stationed in the Southern Guard Tower, one of two towers on the border to Loch Modan. 
He may not be a brewer like the rest of us, Barley Bro. Oh, and don't sell the food, right? Like crack boar, like meat one. stuff. Can you bring because you need it for cooking. For me? Uh, the bread and stuff like that you can sell. But uh, let's say not anything like the stinky wolf meat or the chunk of boar meat, the crack boar rib, stuff like that. You have to keep, right, for cooking. Make a sense uh, to me. Don't worry, take all the time that you need, right? Um, you have to learn this. It's very important. And it's not critical at this level, though. So if you make a mistake, hey, who cares? What can I get for you today? Safe travel. Oh, you can cook here. Yes, 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 yes. Did you cook everything? Wow, you have that little meat on you. Okay. I thought you had a little bit more though, but who cares? All right, one second. I will enchant my braces once more. I will enchant yours, you know, once we have better stuff. Right now, it doesn't really matter. All right, let's go. Let's go and kill some trolls. Don't forget, if there is a, a herb somewhere, click on it on the map, right? Because we do need a lot of all the herbs. Oh, by the way, if you press V, can you press V once? You can see their health bars, right? Um, pop up, I believe. All right, very good. Maybe it's easier for you to see him then, right? You know. Uh, to be honest, I recommend you know doing that anyways for a lot of people. I'm kind of eagle-eyed with these things but it's very important to do that especially in raids or dungeons stuff like that especially if you are ranged but you think you're melee right you know or if you want to walk next to a tank it's all the basic stuff you know oh, look at that a fellow little warlock Could invite her though. Nah, she's gone. All right. All right. I think we might actually be going inside of here. Uh, yeah, we have to anyways. All right. We have to anyways. Yeah, and to the left there are too many right now. All right, Peggy, another cave, another very careful place to be, okay? Nice and slow and steady here. <clears throat> After all, there's no way to run, man, you know? Once they spawn again, you're dead. Yep, you're really, really dead then. Not bad, not bad. Don't just walk forward too fast, even if you can loot. Always check the corners. He really destroyed all of my armor, man. Hey, that's a massive debuff. That's an unhealthy debuff, to be honest. Oh, don't just run to loot, Peggy. Loot is not that important. You almost uh, pulled the one to the left there. That one. <clears throat> one second. Yeah, you can loot him now. Don't you worry. Go loot him. No, 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 no. No, no. Peggy, now you have to loot him. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. <laughs> if loot is that important to you, Peggy, and you have to grab it. Grab it, grab it. Sometimes you just have to tease Peggy a little bit, right, you know? Yeah, just a little bit. Alrighty then, beautiful stuff right here. Nice.
Yeah, I think it could be that we are getting now two upon us, but no. We were lucky here. Very lucky, man. What an episode, though. How we almost... Well, Peggy almost died twice. And Corrigo once. It's getting exciting right now, huh? But yeah, if you want to save level, follow us, right? If Peggy doesn't pull a dumbass move, then uh, you will see the most favorable way to level, though, right? You know? Oh, by the way, Peggy, uh, I need your buff. And you need your two buffs, your own. Don't drink uh, the potions. We have plenty of time on it still. Yep. And me too, the little eye. Thank you. Alrighty. Okay, so apparently we have to go this way. I think. Yep. Yeah. Alright, Peggy 2. Um, let's see. Oh, there's a gnome body there. We can teleport back home. Alright. Yeah, can you do it? Yep, yeah, very good. It's always good to check the map if we are close by or not, you know. It's very important. Oh my god, he just died here. Meg Pippin. Yep, Dunmoreau. Wow. Peggy. That's because of you. I'm kidding. <laughs> let's go down here. Let's go down and let's What's talk to this big mind? boy. Great to meet you. Uh, Hi. Um, we have to burn him something, I think. One second. Uh bit of rifles. Let's see. I have to make the Thunder Brews here. Take this barrel of barley brew. Scare the sneak into the basement of the Thunder Brew delivery cars. Um, I think we do need Thunder Brew. Uh, one second. Uh, you don't have to burn it, by the way. I will burn it. Thunder Ale. There we go. By the way, that's the Rogue Trainer. There. Talk to the Cook Trainer. Cooking is a lifelong pursuit, and I see we share the same learn that uh, cooking skill. Yeah. Oh, you cannot. Peggy, you need to grab some more meat from the animals, though. Go downstairs. Rather right quick. Come on, Peggy, come on. Click on this barrel. Click on it. No, 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 no. This barrel, Peggy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Very good. Me too. Nice. All right. Peggy has pure panic whenever I talk like that, though. It's funny. All right. <laughs> Peggy, talk to your trainer. All right, let's go to my trainer. Where the real magic is uh, being played, right, Peggy? <laughs> okay, then. Uh, interesting answer, though. Interesting answer. Let's see. Wanna make your demons more oh, powerful? yeah. Nice. My demon can do some more damage right now, huh? Oh, there you go. Hey, Peggy. Wow, it does two more damage. Isn't that cool? only corrupts those who are weak. Keep up on your training or you may find a similar thing. Oh, keep up on you. Okay, well, we will, we will, we will. Curse of Agony causes a target with Agony causing 84 shadow damage over 24 seconds. Well, that's really useful, though. Uh, in longer fights, of course. Okay, uh, let's go. No, we don't have time for your funny jokes. <laughs> ah. Okay, uh, Peggy, you oh, get a new rope here, but it's not better than what you have right now, right? Directions are excellent, you know. Let me just finish up my report then. There. Well, haha. Now, this certainly is funny. I don't suppose, adventurer, that you would mind doing one last favor for me? Excellent. Take my report to Senator Baron Redstone. He's a sour type, so don't let his less than sunny disposition get to you. He's in Iron Forge, in the chamber where King Oh, by the way, Peggy, click on that beer and use Polymorph. 
Take the road out of Karanus North, cross the bridge. No, that is not polymorph. The sheep is polymorph. There are large the road, up the yeah, use polymorph. Side. One second. Do you see he gets heavily healed? But now my pet will attack him and directly he's not a sheep anymore. And now I fear him. And I keep fearing him. Useful, right? Very cool stuff. But if my fear is being damaged, that means he will get out of fear too. Not always, but most of the time he will. There we go. Nice, sir. Look at this little ugly one, huh? Yeah. Isn't it your ex? <laughs> Lol. We can only hope that the Gnomish race will be good as new. Big boy, let's talk here. Yes, mm. Interesting fine. knife. I think I'll open a bottle right now and have a taste. All right, very cool. Uh, congratulations, Peggy, on your level up. And we are going to. I think we are going to Iron Forge first. Yeah, why not? We are going to the king's chamber, but I have a bad feeling about his advisor. I think he's very corrupt, though. All right, Peggy, be on your good behavior, all right? We are going to meet the leader of the big people, right? You know, the Dwarven King. Maybe we see him. But we are going to go to his advisor. So be on your best behavior, all right? You know, tall people don't really like to be mocked or be made fun of. They are serious. All right, and here to the left, that is the king, and you better salute him, though, before we enter the rampart here. Salute, there you go. Oh, bowing is good, too, though, yeah, but Bollocks don't bow, there you go. authority of the king has Magni taken complete leave of his senses, and that damnable white beard taken matters into his own hands, has he? The Senate will not be pleased to hear about this, not one bit. What, are you still here? Go before I call the guards. Yeah, he's a bit corrupt, isn't he? Yeah, <laughs> Peggy. <laughs> well, Peggy, you did both twice at the tall people. Respect that, though. And by that, I want to thank you all for two... One second. I just love at him. Indeed, indeed, indeed. There we go. So yeah, by that though, I want to thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Have a wonderful time. And I will see you guys in the next... Never bow for an elf. Never bow for an elf, Peggy. And by that, I want to thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Have a wonderful time. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Stay happy, stay healthy. And don't forget to subscribe though. Bye-bye.